The Miami Dolphins are potentially eyeing Cooper Cup? That's got everyone talking. Let's not sugarcoat this. This is a huge deal if it happens. Cup isn't just any wide receiver. We're talking about the 2021 NFL Offensive Player of the Year, a guy who put up record-breaking numbers, shattered defenses, and played a pivotal role in the Rams' Super Bowl win. He's the kind of player that doesn't just fill a gap, he transforms an offense. And with the NFL trade deadline creeping up on November 5th, you have to wonder, could the Dolphins actually pull this off? We know the Rams are struggling. They're 1-4, to four, out of the playoff picture, and facing a team that needs to start thinking about the future rather than the present. Cooper Cup, though dealing with an ankle injury, is a name floating around as a potential trade piece. The Rams might be willing to part ways with their star wide receiver, and the Dolphins, well, they might just be desperate enough to make the call. Now, some might ask, why would the Dolphins want to add another wide receiver when they already have Tyreek Hill and Jalen Waddell? And that's a fair question. But this is where things get interesting. First off, there's some uncertainty in Miami. Tua Tagovailoa has been up and down with injuries, and though he's expected to return soon, the reality is that the Dolphins' window to compete is starting to close. Tyreek Hill isn't getting any younger, and we all know how fragile NFL careers can be. So, why not go all in right now? Adding Cooper Cup could be the statement this team needs to make. It's a declaration that says, we're going for it, no matter what. Of course, this wouldn't be a simple move. Cup is under contract until 2026, but that deal is loaded with financial complexities. His contract isn't exactly team-friendly for anyone thinking long-term. He's due a hefty roster bonus, and that's just the beginning of the financial juggling act any team trading for him would have to manage. So why would Miami consider it? Because sometimes, you have to take a risk if you want to win big. And the Dolphins might just be at the point where they have no other choice. But let's think about what Cup could bring to this Miami offense. You've got Tyreek Hill, who's still one of the most electrifying players in the game. You've got Jalen Waddell, who's dynamic in his own right. But after that, the Dolphins' wide receiver depth falls off a cliff. Adding a guy like Cup, someone who's an elite route runner, with reliable hands and an incredible football IQ, could push this offense over the top. We're talking about a team that could dominate through the air. Opposing defenses wouldn't know where to focus. Double team Tyreek? Fine, now you've got Cup slicing through your secondary. Focus on Cup? Jalen Waddle's ready to burn you deep. It's a nightmare scenario for defensive coordinators. And don't forget, Chris Greer and Mike McDaniel are under pressure. They know their jobs could be on the line if this season doesn't turn around. They're sitting at 2-3, a record that doesn't exactly scream Super Bowl contender. But if Tua comes back healthy and they add Cup, suddenly, this offense becomes one of the most dangerous in the league. It's not hard to imagine the Dolphins making a deep playoff run with that kind of firepower. They'd be sending a clear message to the rest of the NFL, we're not done yet. Still, it's not without its risks. Miami's already committed a ton of money to their wide receivers. Tyreek Hill's on a massive deal, and Jalen Waddle won't be cheap when his rookie contract is up. Throwing another big contract into the mix for Cup could be tough to manage, especially if Tua's future remains uncertain. Can Miami really afford to gamble like this? And then there's Cup himself. He's no stranger to injuries. He's missed time in the past, and at 31, he's not exactly in the prime of his career anymore. But when he's healthy, he's one of the best in the business. The question is, can Miami trust that he'll stay healthy enough to justify the investment? So, here we are. The Dolphins have a chance to make a bold move, a game changer that could alter the course of their season, and maybe their franchise. Will they take the plunge? Will they add Cooper Cup to an already explosive offense? Or will they play it safe, stick with what they have, and hope Tua and the current roster can get the job done? Time's ticking, and the trade deadline is just around the corner.